Some big news out of Bush Stadium this afternoon where word spread that Guns and Roses would not be performing tonight at Bush Stadium. News 11's Jeff Bernthal live downtown with more on the unfortunate news and it's tomorrow night that was supposed to be the concert, Jeff. That's right, uh, Micah. Certainly no shortage of history between Guns N' Roses and St. Louis, that's for sure. We'll have more on that in just a minute. But first, the announcement today citing an illness for the reason the concert is being postponed. No other specifics about that, but certainly we've heard from some disappointed fans expecting to see that uh, concert here in downtown St. Louis on Saturday. Let's give you the view from Bomberita Automotive Group Sky Fox from earlier today flying over Bush Stadium as the uh, stage has been taken down. Guns and Roses scheduled to play here with the Pretenders. We also have some uh, time-lapse video that we can show you of the stage coming down. It appeared that the teardown started around 10 o'clock this morning. Statements from the Cardinals and Live Nation advise anyone with a ticket to hang on to their tickets because they say the event organizer is working to reschedule the concert. Earlier this month, GNR singer Axl Rose issued an apology after a concert in New York sharing on social media he was a little hoarse. Now, we spoke with one downtown business owner near the stadium about today's news. It's kind of a bummer because uh, I'm sure everybody downtown was expecting on the big crowds coming into Bush Stadium with the Cardinals kind of laying an egg on us recently. So the crowds would have been good. Uh, I'm sure the restaurants and the bars are going to be losing out in the parking. And we were we were stocking up. Now, here's that video from uh, 1991. Guns N' Roses making national headlines following what became known as the Riverport Riot. Axl Rose uh, jumping into the crowd, uh, angry someone was recording the concert. He was prosecuted. The group stayed away from St. Louis for years, put a scheduled date on the tour in 2016, but then dropped that date, uh, citing a lack of venue as a reason. Some thought perhaps it was an April Fool's joke uh, before they eventually returned in 2017. Now we will have more on this announcement, the postponement to no concert here on Saturday, no future date scheduled as of yet. We'll have more tonight on Fox 2. Reporting live from downtown, Jeff Bernthal, News 11.